In this example, we're going to evaluate this determinant, and it looks like we have a nice 2 by 2 square matrix. So in order to evaluate this determinant, we need to do a couple of products, and then we'll subtract them. So this main diagonal here has these two fractions. We're going to multiply them together first. And then the minor diagonal here, the other way, we're going to multiply those fractions, and then we're going to subtract those two products. So let's go ahead and write that expansion out to see what it looks like. So it'll be 9 halves for that first term times 7 ninths. And from that, we'll subtract these entries in the minor diagonal, negative 9 fourths and negative 10 thirds. Okay, so let's just go ahead and do each of these products and then subtract. So for this first multiplication, it looks like these 9s will actually cancel and leave us with just 7 halves, okay? And then we'll be subtracting. Looks like these are both negative, so we can cancel those negatives out. And between the 9 and the 3, it looks like I can cancel down to 3 and 1, respectively. And between the 4 and the 10, it looks like I can cancel a 2 out, so 2 and 5, respectively. So I multiply across, looks like 15 halves. Okay, so this is what I have now for the, our subtraction. And so let's finish it off by subtracting. 7 minus 15 is negative 8 over that 2, which can be reduced to negative 4. So the determinant then for this 2 by 2 square matrix, even though it contains fractions, it'll come out to be nice, negative 4.